Welcome back, everyone. Today is another episode of From. This is Season 2, Episode 7. The title is Belly of the Beast. The last episode was alright. We got to see Boyd transfer his blood into one of the monsters, and it seemingly killed them, but we don't know for sure. Uh, we still need confirmation if it actually killed them. But um, yeah, not a whole lot to say. I just want to get right into the episode. So let's get into it. Previously on From. No, 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 I think people are watching us. We've got to start working together on this. But who? Go. Who's watching? She if his theory to is correct, what the fuck? <laughs> you have to get out before the music stops. Ah, ah, ah. How many times will we see this my blood transfusion? Your blood now. Jesus. I got worms under my skin, and it feels like something's coming for me now. We can't have new people stealing what little food we have! Get outside! Yep. Come on. See you later, Davey. You might be going into the box. Hey, Christy, what's happening? We're gonna relieve the pressure, alright? No, I can't put my blood into it. squirted into his mouth. My blood is your blood. Yeah, you get him, boy. Kill him. Although, I kind of wish... The creepy ginger stayed a little longer because he was very creepy. But you didn't. Okay? Oh, she's pregnant. She's Did pregnant. You something? Do you have any pregnancy tests? That's y'all's fault for fucking without protection. I know these aren't the most ideal conditions, but women have been giving birth for thousands of years. Right? Yeah, but and... not under this circumstance. Look, talk to Ellis. The three of us can... I, I can't. I, I don't want her to say anything to him yet. Altima, what's going on? Altima, we should go. She's fucking pregnant. Sorry, That's the problem. How is she going to raise a child in this hellhole? It's still there. Oh. It's dead? Maybe? Alright. It won't attack when it's daylight, right? I mean, there are rules in this town. Ooh. This is gonna pop up and scare ya. You really did it. You killed one of them. Yeah. What do we do with the body? That is so good. That's good news. It. They can die. No. We take it inside. Now you're gonna study it. Tell me you're joking. You have to study no, he's it. That's right. This is this is our chance to learn about them. Mm -hmm. We can study them, open them up, see what they yes. look like on the inside. We we don't even know if it's safe to touch this thing. You're talking about about operating on it. Strap it down. You tie you it. Lock it up. It's your call. Let's bring it in. Mm-hmm. I'll get Definitely. A sheet. Thanks. I'll grab yeah. some sticks. Kenny's Oops. like, I'm dumbfounded you right here. <laughs> Keep the bandage nice and dry, and I'll check on you later. Okay. Let's go. Yeah. He's like, this is horse shit. Yeah. Nope, you vexed him. What? He's annoyed. You all right? I'm fine. He's acting weird. What's the problem, Elgin? You guys. All right, can we, can we please just stop and talk about this for a second? You're about to willingly bring something evil into your home. Shut the fuck up, Kenny. Do you understand that? Duh. I do. I also Duh, understand, we understand. That we may never get this opportunity again. So is that it? All right, let's go. Get to work. Get to studying. Wow, here we go. I hope we get to see them cut it up. Is Ellis going to be okay? I'm sorry, but what happened to Ellis? I really am. He's a, he's a good kid. Mm hmm. Okay, if he is sincerely sorry, from the then maybe he There's deserves a second chance. Here. Yes, he's right. Way too many people. There's some hard choices coming, and no one here seems willing to make them. 
I'd be careful how much you lobby for people to make hard choices. Oh, that means you might be put in the box. I mean, he's being locked up anyways. Gets in or out. Right. Yeah, so what happened, Sam? Him. He mm. wanted us to go outside in the middle of the night. He was mm. ready to put both of us out. Into yeah, that. I heard the recap. <laughs> and I'm asking you what you're gonna do about it. I promise you, you are safe here, and we are gonna figure this out. You're one of us. Fuck what in the room, notwithstanding, we take care mm -hmm. of our people. You're one of them now. Okay. That's right. It's good to see okay. you alive, okay. Alice. Lean right on me. I'm not ready. Hey. Pancakes. Never argue with a master chef. I want to see Victor today. Oh, I, I don't think that's a good idea, buddy. Why? Why not? I can take. He's him. not a predator. Go there anyway. Nobody's going to Colony House. Hey, Jim. I think it's okay for them to go. Okay. Uh, we talk outside. He looks like he just got out of bed. <laughs> His hair is Thanks like. Pancakes, okay. You looking a little unkempt there, Jim. What's up? I don't know what's going on with you. Excuse me? Mm -hmm. We have what? to be a team here. What the fuck? So when I say no one goes to Colony House and you immediately undermine me, okay, it doesn't what, help. What do you want to do? Oh, back to the divorce. Do you want to lock them in the basement? Back on the divorce train. Can't just lock them away until we find a way home. Mm -hmm. You want them sneaking out? Because that's what will happen. This way we know right. where they're going. We know they're together. They're still don't rebellious young, young children. Hanging out with some emotionally stunted freak who walks around town with a gun in his lunchbox. Wait, wait, wait. No, that emotionally stunted freak saved your daughter's life. Are you talking about Victor? And he saved mine. Or maybe that's what they want you to think. I heard a voice on the radio. Why is that nothing for because you? Because I think you're wrong. Jim is pissing me off again. If you have been down in those tunnels... If you've seen what I saw, maybe that's what they wanted you to see. She's oh, mentioning God. the tunnel for the first time ever. <gasps> okay. What? Oh. It only took seven episodes. I've seen those things. Up close, Jim. I've seen them. You're so sure this voice you heard on the radio. Have you ever stopped to wonder if that voice was even a person? Yeah, you're being of deceived, Jim. Is mind fucking what else with do you? you. Think it was a mind fuck. I don't know. <laughs> Why is Jim so skeptical about everything that's happened, but he's very adamant about the voice on the radio? What the hell? A drone? What? Oh. What's that gonna do? Oh, you gave Jim an idea. Hmm. How's this work? What do you need? What do you need? It looks like it has some sort of rib cage. We'll probably need a saw. Uh, gloves wouldn't be a bad idea either. Mm -mm. PPE. Right. You're kidding. Personal you protection equipment. Storage that we can use. Oh, he's so gnarly. Kidding. Nice teeth. So what happened to the worms? Huh? Are they dead too? What do you? Excuse me. They went into his body. Oh. Duh. Hey. hey. Is she pregnant too? Hey. There he oh. Hey. Uh, hey. You ever get so sick you can't make it to the bathroom? She's going through with and you just go wherever. Uh, is there anything we can? Any gloves and something to cut through bone. I don't want this thing down here any longer than it needs to be, so let's just do it and get it done, okay? Let's go. You know you have a very limited okay. supply. We're gonna get gloves, or a scalpel, or anything. Hey, sorry about the flyby. I was just fucking around. That's all right. You're pretty good with that thing. You don't have to be sorry. It's supposed to be for my nephew's birthday. Mm. Figured I'd get my money's worth. Mm -hmm. I never thanked you for what you did the other day, helping out down in the basement. Seeing as your wife wasn't even down there, it kind of seems like you got those two other guys killed for nothing. Yeah, yep. That feel good <laughs> just now saying that? Buddy, Jim, you say awful okay. things all the time. You should thank you. You're welcome. And what else you want from me? Take a walk with me. I want to show you something. You sound like one of those fucking perverts that hang out at playgrounds. What is wrong with you? What's wrong with you, Jim? Are you serious? You're getting your own medicine. Okay. Fucking prick. 
What if I told you that drone might get you home in time for your nephew's birthday? Then I'd say you're full of shit. Oh, he's gonna believe it. What are you doing here? I came to see you. Go away. It's just, it's safer for you to stay away from me. Why? Oh, the trees are just moving. Bad things happen to my f friends here. That's how they're changing. That's what well, he said in season one, correct? Can't be friends. I think. Okay. Bye. The orange was dry. Mm. What? The orange marker. The markers you gave me. The orange was dry. It was a bad gift. <laughs> Oh God. Sorry. That's why he's mad at you. There's a lot of measuring to do. <gasps> Yay! Best friends again. I guess we can help if That's you want. That's all Ethan want. ever wanted. Was to be your friend. <sighs> he needs you out there. Is wait. she having withdrawals? Just go. Due to not there. having any drugs in her I'm system. Fine. You're shivering here. Just do what you need to do. Shit. Let's try and drink some water, okay? Morella, oh. is she gonna die? Is she okay? Not great. She's trying to sleep. Let me help you with that. Yes. Um, Boy, you can't do everything yourself. Uh, when I met her, she had been sober for almost a year. She worked so hard. She was so proud. Those damn relapses. And I, I didn't even notice she was going through withdrawal because I was so caught up in that fucking thing. I, I... No, Kenny's right. We have no idea what we're in for once we open that thing up. Now you're on Kenny's side? You don't want to, like, take the chance of knowing what could be used to stop them? Are you scared? Yeah. Yeah, me too. I just want to see them cut it yeah. up already. What are you doing? Well, you've arrived at a fortuitous time. I think I uh, figured out how to make the alcohol not taste like stomach acid. Great. <sighs> when you found me in the woods the other day, I was rolling on the ground and screaming. You were not surprised. Why? Because he sees things too. Your husband found me like that once before. Well, to be fair, I wasn't entirely forthcoming with the details. Got up, and I told him to fuck off, and then I ran away. Jim deserves foul language into his face. I was being attacked by a very angry Civil War soldier. That's all you get. You want more? You gotta help me with this. Great. Now she has to do something for him to get answers. You sent out a call for help. Someone actually answered, and no one's doing anything about that. You seem this is one big mind fuck designed to My words. Those are my words. I've been saying mind fuck the entire season. Wondering why you haven't asked yourself the obvious question. And it never occurred to you that some of the people here might be in on it. I mean they'd have to be. How else do you keep the experiment on track? Who? Who could be in on it? The old lady. And Elgin is getting a little suspicious with his quietness. But you guys are both okay. We're fine. Yeah. I miss you guys. Mm, that's right. I she was like too. their roommate for. You're always welcome. A season, right? I thought you two might be hungry. And I thought we were in the middle of a food shortage. Well, we you are get in good food because of, of your little stabby slaps. But it never should have happened in the first place. Yeah. I should have been here. Mm hmm Sorry. It's okay. Well, He's I'm... alive. It's all right. All right, it's time to eat. Oh, she needs to tell him about the little pregnancy. Oh, hey. hey. We have to stop meeting like this. On the on the porch. Mm -hmm. Oh, You're right. Clearly, that's what she meant. Uh, uh, you have time for a walk? Okay. Mm -hmm. really I don't know if I trust him. You know, there might be more than one person in on whatever is going on. How can I help? Catch me if I fall. 
Sorry, bad joke. I'm uh, just gonna make an incision across the chest, okay? Mm, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Fuck! It, it, it's it's fine. I, I just I think I just hit a nerve or something. No, 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 stop, stop, stop. No, wait, still wait, alive. Just, wait, wait, Jesus Christ! Stop! We should have fucking burned it. We shouldn't be doing this. You, uh, hey, fucking you already crazy. said that. Hey, hey. I got it. I got it. Jesus, can we just fucking Kenny. get somewhere? Kenny! Kenny, stop! Fucking stop! Seriously, quit He's acting like a fucking away. child. If we could extract it and, and use it, we may finally have a way of fighting back. Or there's something in there that'll kill you. The moment you open that thing up, how do you not see that? I'm willing to take that risk. Look, like Kenny, airborne? all I do here is put broken things back together. We're in this together, remember? You and me. Mm hmm I don't think he wants to be your friend anymore. No, we're not. No, he's done. Not anymore. Seriously? Are you fucking kidding me? No, I'm... That's all I'm saying. <sighs> Look, it's because okay. of Morella? It's okay. I'm glad what? she's here. Truly, I am. I... I knew... That's... I knew. I knew it. Chrissy... I love you. What? How the fuck and do you love her? all I want is for you to be happy about But I can't go in there and watch you do something that might get you killed. I just, I can't do that. I can't handle this scene. I hate it. I'm sorry. I hate Kenny. He Chrissy. knew she was a fucking lesbian in with someone. Go the fuck inside and help. Quit being a bitch. Christy? Oh god, she's having like an episode or something. Withdrawal symptoms. Christy? That's where the monster is in, right? It's gone. You feeling okay? Where is it? What? The body. The body. Run. There you go. Oh my god. Is this real? She's not having an Okay. I thought it was something. Not real. It was just a dream. Fuck. Should have known. Plants keep dying. It's like they're growing in poisoned soil. Boyd, all he ever wanted was to find. I'm pregnant. Mm -hmm. Lay it out. Just lay it out. Oh, sweetie. Oh, oh she's happy. Oh, oh. She's golly oh, about it. I wish I could have seen face when he found out he was going to be a dad. I haven't said anything to him yet. Is he not? No. Of course he is. Um, <laughs> is he not the father? He's the father. He's the father. <laughs> Donna, I was told I can't have kids. From whom? A doctor? What's happening right now is medically impossible. It's the town. And all I can think is, what if... It's a monster? This place is trying to torture me. Mm-hmm. Mock me. Like those things that come out at night, the way they smile at us. What if this is just another? <laughs> Donna, you need to fucking listen. Don't laugh. What's happening? I'm standing here thinking I am at the end of the line. That everything I thought about this place was. You thought you saw the end of it. We have seen mm -hmm. unbelievable shit in this place. Mm -hmm. According to Boyd, there are evil fucking trees that trap you in dungeons. Yeah, he's right. Don't ask. <laughs> she still has no idea about that. The point is, we have seen a lot of horrible, impossible shit. And you think a pregnancy that was not meant to be is a good sign? You're going to have a baby that you were told you could never have. That sounds like a pretty good impossible to me. Mm-mm. There's something sinister behind her pregnancy. I 
you're going to sit here and tell me with all you've seen that you can't wrap your head around How is it there. impossible? Tell us. Because a miracle is just the other side of a nightmare. She got her tubes tied. What is it? What if you're wrong? She's dead wrong. What if I'm right? Focus on how it's not possible for her to get pregnant. It was easily the creepiest fucking thing I've ever experienced in my life. Wait, Christopher? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. The guy that went crazy? Oh, yeah. Christopher's the guy holding the journal. You see that kid in the background? Yeah, that's Victor. Wow, you caught that a lot quicker than I did. <laughs> okay, so... That's funny. For you, what you see is different every time? Oh, except for the symbol. Why? What do you see? Oh my god, thank you. They're having conversations about what they're seeing. I just see children. Their visions, oh, like, hallucinations. Like little kids? Yeah. Yeah, but... It's because of her child that she lost. fucking terrifying. <laughs> I thought I was losing my mind or I was being punished. Punished for what? Because of oh, Thomas. My... It's Thomas. My son Thomas was a few months old when he died, so. Yeah. Fuck. And what's Christopher's connection to, to Jade? Maybe this is just a fucked up place where scary shit happens. Mm hmm. Very scary. There's no explanation why. What is it? Wait, is this the symbol you were talking about? Mm -hmm. She yeah. saw it in the cave. I pointed that out, that it was crazy. in the cave. I've seen this. Yeah, like in a vision or something? No. Somewhere no, much worse. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what tunnels? It's about time she is mentioning the tunnels. You think you should fucking said something a lot sooner? Considering that's where the monsters come from? They're losing their leaves. Yeah, it's the season. What? The season's changing. The trees. Oh, it's always the same here. Always the same. Oh. Well, how would we know that? We've only been here for like one and a half leaves? seasons. When things change here, it's usually bad. Very bad. Why? Well, it's never happened before. Maybe it's good. Look at him being optimistic about things. Mm. Now we have to remove the sternum. Right. Oh god, this part right here. What? Here we go, right here. The bone. You have a change of heart, Kenny. Hmm? One, two, three. <gasps> oh. Ugh. Does it smell? Oh, fuck. What is it? It doesn't look it's normal. Human. Oh. Heart, liver, but they're shriveled, D desiccated. It's like some some shit that you see at a museum. Yeah, like a dried up mushroom. This thing is bone dry inside. There's there's no there's no fluid. There's no lip. There's there's no there's, juice. There's nothing. It's okay. it's no, it's not okay. This was our chance. Yeah. This this, this couldn't have been for nothing. Okay. It's gotta be. <laughs> Dig deeper. <laughs> Keep looking for clues. There's gotta be something in here. I think when Boyd transferred the blood, it like dried him out. Oh, hey, be careful. <laughs> careful. What is that? What's that stuff? What is that? That's the gallbladder. Yeah. That's, um, bile? Is it that's bile. Bile, I was right. That's bile. That's yeah, it's made from good, the right? it's liquid. made from the liver. It might be something we could use, right? Yeah, maybe something. Maybe you got damn right that's something. Bile is something. Bile is something. Yo, could you give me one of Bile the is important you know, can, in the human body. It. Yo, you did good. You did great. I knew that was bile because bile is usually like a lime green, yellowish color in this area. <laughs> In this area down there. I don't know if what I'm supposed to remember is real or if my mind is just so messed up that no, no. I mean, who knows what's real crazy. and what's a hallucination or a vision or something. 
soon as you start to think, you know, maybe today I won't go and see. <laughs> Something new comes yeah. along and it's like, hey, wait till you see this. Right. We all go through it. You seem pretty together. She's tough. Seriously? She's pretty tough. <laughs> I do have this little trick, though. I fill up the bathtub and I sink down just enough so that the water is level with my ears. I just sit like that for a while and I breathe. That's all you do is float in the tub? It's peaceful. I don't take baths. Ooh. Okay. Well, then I don't know how to help you. <laughs> you know, he was kind of flirty with Sarah. Now he's doing it with... You okay? Julie. Hmm. Don't trust him. You okay? I got some big-ass news to tell you. I am. There's something I need to tell you. Here we go. She's gonna tell him. You really think injecting them with that stuff's gonna kill him? Hopefully. Honestly, I got no fucking <laughs> idea. It's the best chance we got. How are we even gonna test yeah, them? Yeah, that's the question. You have to trap one of them. I'll tell you what. Let's make that a problem for tomorrow. <laughs> Set a trap. She go home? Uh, tell Chris. But what you... happens if one of the monsters yeah. stays hey. outside and is exposed to the sun. Hey, Kenny. Will that do anything? You ever want that badge back? I'll see you around. Yeah. He don't want to be your deputy. This is why you should never do drugs. Cause your body like is dependent on it after a while and then when you try to go back really uh, it wears you down i slept wait and see i had a bad dream oh no what was it about that thing in the basement came alive and i think there was a music box <laughs> She's starting to see things. <laughs> Your friend Boyd's giving me his nightmares. I'll be sure to talk to him about that. <laughs> she's gonna die. I'm gonna be all right now. I have a feeling she's going to die. You don't have to worry about me. She's sick and it's getting closer to the finale. I think we have to worry. this oh shit the music box <laughs> a few people freaking see it and hear it what the hell what the fuck he elgin might be dead <laughs> damn 